a question for Mr. McGurk. Uh, is this ISIS strategy that we've seen take all this territory back from Iraq and Syria, is that essentially the Obama strategy, or did something change under this administration? I think we've made some pretty significant – it's moving faster, more efficiently, more effectively. Uh, pretty significant changes made in terms of delegations to, of authorities. A very important decision was made uh, back in May about how to prosecute the Raqqa campaign uh, that the President made, which allowed us, I think, to complete the Raqqa operation. So um, I think it's moving faster, more efficiently, more effectively due to some really critical changes that were made in the strategic review uh, led by Secretary Mattis and the whole inter interagency team with Secretary uh, Tillerson and the Chairman. So having just come back, actually, I was in Syria last week, uh, you can really get a sense of the momentum uh, that's really building now. Uh, our training classes for the forces we're training are all full. Uh, we have more recruits than we can train. So it's really kind of taken on a, a really positive uh, momentum, a snowball effect. And so we feel uh, pretty good about it. In, in addition to what Mr. McGurk said, I, I, think, I think he would agree. I, I'd also point to uh, the continued capability development of our partners on the ground. So if you look at where the Iraqis were in the fall of 2015 and you compare their combat capability to 2017, uh, they have improved significantly over the last two years. If you look at where we were in the fall of 2015, at one point I think we had identified about 175 partners in Syria that we had trained uh, and were available, maybe uh, some hundreds that were available to fight. Uh, we now have over 50,000 partners on the ground, half of those partners uh, Arab partners, and so the growth of our partners over time compared to the decision-making process and, uh, and, frankly, the momentum that it all has generated, I think, has, has fed the success that we have seen in Rock and Mosul. And I, the only thing I'd add, too, is that one of our themes today was that uh, this is an inflection point. It's not the end of the campaign, and, uh, and a strong emphasis on the need to keep the coalition that Mr. McGurk has, has helped to craft. Uh, to keep that coalition together for the long term. 